This video will show you how to start working with Plastic SEM and an already existing Unity project. First, create an empty Unity project like this one. Then, configure the Plastic SEM plugin by opening the Edit, Project Settings, Editor Preferences. Choose Plastic SEM at the Version Control drop down menu. Now, you will need to specify some information to let the Plastic SEM client connect with the Plastic SEM server. Type at the repository name field the name of the Plastic SEM repository that is already keeping the Unity project you want to start working with. The workspace name will be the name for the local workspace where your Unity project has been created. A Plastic SEM workspace is a working copy of the Plastic SEM repository used to create changes and retrieve changes from others. The last parameter is the Gluo mode. Plastic SEM supports two different workflows, one for developers and one for artists. The artist one is called Gluon, and you can learn more about it from our website. If this is your first time setting up Unity and Plastic, I recommend you to set this mode to false. After completing all the information, you can click the Connect button. The status will display connected once the workspace is created. Now, in order to get the existing Unity project content, open the window version control view. You will find that the incoming changes tab is plenty of content. Simply click apply all incoming changes to get all the Unity project content. Unity will process all the assets downloaded from the Plastic SEM repository. This process may take a while the first time.